The important thing to remember for this problem is that the magnitude of the electric field produced by a point charge is equal to the Coulomb constant multiplied by the magnitude of the charge producing the electric field divided by the square of the distance between the charge producing the electric field and the point we're analyzing. In this problem, we're asked to find the magnitude of that charge, so we're going to be taking this equation and algebraically solving it for the charge Q. So we're taking this whole equation and solving for Q. So this is pretty simple algebra. We just multiply both sides of the equation by R squared and divide both sides of the equation by the Coulomb constant K. So we find that the magnitude of the charge is equal to the square of the distance multiplied by the magnitude of the field divided by the Coulomb constant. So let's just plug in the numbers we have. So the charge is equal to the square of the distance, which is given in the problem as 50 centimeters. So that's the square of 0.5 meters multiplied by the electric field, which is given in the problem as 2 newtons per coulomb. So 2 newtons per coulomb divided by the Coulomb constant, which is 8.99 times 10 to the power of 9 newton meters squared per coulomb squared. And if we put that into a calculator, we find a charge magnitude of about 5.6 times 10 to the power of negative 11 coulombs. And that is it for this problem. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please consider subscribing as that'll help me out in making more videos just like this. And if you have a request or a question, leave a comment down below, and I hope you all have a lovely day. Bye-bye.